Well, hey guys, it's Mark from One Day at a Time. We uh, we got some rain. It's about four, four straight weeks of nothing, so we got some rain. So, it's burning. I know, I'm gonna go get y'all some hay. I didn't put no hay out because I didn't want it to get all wet, so I'm getting some hay. What are y'all doing? Look at Moo Moo. Where you going, Moo Moo? All right, I'm gonna get the cart, get some hay. What's up, Precious? What y'all doing? So, it seems like we, our guinea hen came back, something attacked one of them. I think it was that one right there. Um, they seem to be doing good. So, hey, my girls, what y'all doing? Anyway, um, so we got some rain. Knock the dust down. They're happy. I'm happy. I'm not breathing dust. So, still pretty hot though. So we're waiting for that cool front to come through and cool us off. Um, all right, Vern, I know. So our, our babies are getting some, uh, big, whoa, almost slipped in the mud. What y'all doing? What y'all doing? There's five of them. She hatched them out. And this little hen right here was the one that we call Tweety that we ordered her. And uh, she got hurt on a transport here or something in her leg. So Jean nursed her back to life. And look at how healthy she is now. Look what she did. So, look how pretty. Need some scratch. So, getting some fresh water. So, I think I'll. Some of our hens are they're getting old. So, we, um, you know, we got the. And then some of them jump the fence and run off in the woods. We don't know what happened to them. But so what we're gonna do is probably let let a couple of these hens um, sit again, and you know just produce some more birds for us. And um, that's my girl, Big Bertha, right there. So I would love to get her to sit because she, she's pretty and she lays some big eggs. So I'd love to get her to sit, but we'll have to see. What happens? <laughs> kind of hard filling the water up when you're holding a phone. Huh? So anyway, guys. Um. So we we're gonna try to get her to set. He looks like he's been trying to, you know, make baby turkeys. So we're gonna try to get her to set so we can get some baby turkeys out the deal. And then um. Uh, I think we sold um, some of the goats, not the not our breeders, but the babies. But, um, so, it's a farm, so we try to make try to make it work. You know, where we can return our money on the feed and so uh, and cookie and peanut. They just I don't know. I mean, we love them, but they're not producing what we thought we was going to get from them. So, we have a surprise coming with um, them. So, 
I guess they'll be here about eight weeks from now. Um, so, but I think that little male, that little buck right there, he sold. I think that Kiko buck is sold. Um, I know them two right there are sold. So we're going to get rid of all of them. I think we're going to keep, um, where's Moo Moo? Oh, well, that's Sylvia. So we will be keeping, um, we're going to keep Moo Moo. Sylvia's baby. So that's going to be, uh, be something. That... <sighs> so. I was really praying that cookie and peanut. Um, you know. Um, made bacon. They didn't make no bacon. We had them. Um, they're, they're fully matured. You can see they matured. Um, so, clean them out tomorrow. So, um, so I've been working long hours. It's been hard, y'all. It's been kind of difficult, but hey, we maintain them, and um, they're all doing good. I'm glad it did rain though, because it it really does help. So, what's up, Vernon? So Vernon wants to thank everybody for doing life together with us, huh? So he, what's up out there, y'all? One day at a time. Huh. So we just want to thank everybody for supporting us, watching our videos, and um, hanging with us. So we thank y'all for doing life together with us. One day at a time. Everybody has a good one.